Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Doctor Who, The Edge of Reality. So what I have done, as I switch my screen back, is I have uploaded this save, because this is a PS4 game on PS5, so I've uploaded the save to um, the cloud, PlayStation Cloud or whatever it is, cloud storage, so that if... If the save gets corrupted again, I can just download it and we'll be fine. So, but anyway, we're going to go ahead and get right back into the brand new stuff. So this is brand new, I've not seen this. Oh, yes. You like the well, I must have a bit. No, teeny bit. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. In fact, I reckon her. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, I cannot mm. wait to see River's face. She'll be in seven. Sorry, sorry. Easily distracted. Did our doctor send you here? A, nobody sent me anywhere. Two, mm. I'm here because of the time glitches sending everything all timey wimey lemon and lime. And, timey wimey. Why? A friend of mine gave me a tip-off about a million years from now. Or was it last week? Anyway, point is, I need your help. We'd love to muck in, Doctor. But we're trying to work out where our Doctor is. And then there's the little matter of us having to save reality. Sounds fun. Well, I say fun. I'm guessing it's slightly stressful. Well, I say slightly. Doctor! Uh, uh, that easily distract... Keep the screwdriver Happening. selected. Happening again. Do you know where she is? No, but I know what's waiting for you out there. How do you know what's going on when you're from the past? Like I said, I've got a friend. A friend from the future who's telling me what you need to know. Can't reveal too much, otherwise I'll break the Blinovich paradox and I could destabilize oh. the universe. Uh, oh, yes. Yes. Right. I'm not sure I follow you. Well, uh, uh, it's a fancy way of saying I can't give you too many spoilers, but... The thing hmm. you know as the reality virus has been modified by some old friends of mine. Who's in control of it now? The Cybermen. Yeah! So the time glitches the virus causes are going to get more extreme. In your reality, where you are right now, the Cybermen have already conquered Earth. That's done. Nothing can change that. You've got to find out what their next move is because it's going to be big. And you're going to have to stop it. How can we stop the Cybermen? Not going to lie, it's a big ask. But... Somewhere out there in the junkyard, there's the head of a decapitated Cyberman. Find it. Any reason? Or shouldn't I ask? It should reveal what the Cybermen are planning. Then you have to find the Doctor and... And that's it. That's all I can tell you. Sorry. Sorry. You're on your own from this point. You can't just leave us. No, don't go. Uh, well, you kind of can. kind of have to. But if it's any consolation... I have a funny feeling we'll meet again. Look, right now, I've got planets to save. And you've got to stop the universe conking out. So what are we all waiting for? Allons-y! Okay. Allons-y! I think the Doctor might have upgraded the song. Try it on the door now. Allons-y! Oh... <gasps> oh, 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 no, thank you. Uh, oh, I'll be deleted. Yes, I've done a quick scan, and it looks like the cyber skull is on the other side of the junkyard. Okay. Sure. Sure. Oh, 
Sure, sure. So this is all brand new. Now we're getting into the heart of the game and David Tennant. You will join us or be deleted. Give oh. it a quick blast with the sonic screwdriver. Yes. Point one. This cyber unit is equipped with gamma. Alas, poor handles. Point two. Planet Earth has been reconfigured. It is now assigned to the new cyber empire. Humanity will be upgraded. Point uh. three. The reality virus has been reformatted using superior Mondasian technology. Point four. Gamma level security includes a notification protocol. Your presence has been detected and reported to the nearest Thanks. cyber ship. Point five, you will be deleted. The cyber ship. Well, we've really got their attention now. Oh, oh, oh. It looks like the target is on the cyber ship, and they got it up there using some sort of transmat system. If the target is on the mother ship, it's a knocking bet the doctor's up there too. Get to the base of the cyber tower. I can operate the transmat device to get us on board. You've just got to hold them for a few more seconds whilst I trigger the like transmat. Like traveling in a food mixer. Okay, we're about to transmat ourselves out oh. of here. Yay, transmat. The reality virus must have done its thing and... I think it's a cyber warship. Have a poke around. Oh, this well, is I so freaking cool. Systems. This is so awesome. Points, and it's good news, bad news time. Bad news is, this ship is en route to Telos. The Cybermen are looking to revive their frozen armies hidden away there, so the extra soldiers can take advantage of the chaos caused by their reality virus. But the good news is, I've detected an individual with two hearts. Gotta be the doctor. Let's find him. But be careful. Or him. This place is crawling with Cybermen and their nasty little pets, the Cybermats. There are cameras in the corridors, so there must be a security feed we can hack into. No, I won't. Uh, I won't join you or be deleted. Thank you. This is such, this is so cool. See that wall screen? Maybe we can decrypt some useful intel. Brilliant. Now we can oh. see what the Cybermen are up to. Looks like we can take control of the Cybermats from here. Predator Silverware. Whoa! Yeah! Yeah, you get in the corner! You get. Excuse me? This is so cool, guys. I'm sorry, I'm geeking out right now. This is what I wanted. Like, I mean, obviously, more David Tennant. We haven't gotten enough David Tennant at all. I'm sorry. Cybermen. I can't do the voice. Pretend to be cyber might. Is there multiple? Maximum deletion. You will be deleted. 
contact. Okay, bye. I'll go this way then. Cyber Reaper! A hunter, a legend. It can't be. I thought they were just ghost stories. Legends? Warnings. Legend suggests that the Cyber Reaper was born at the end of the last great cyber war. What is it doing here? It must be the reality virus. Oh, that makes a lot of sense, actually. The light's green now. Anything? Secrets? Secrets? Hey, I can detect an individual with two hearts below us. Take the elevator down. Goodbye. David Tennant? Bye. Look, another control panel. Where? Jerk. Can I go this way then? Was it literally just those two? Huh. That's the guy above. So yeah, that, it, maybe it was just those two. Cyberman. The cyber. Some of the Cyberman episodes were actually pretty ki kind of. Oh, oh, hey, there she is. Hey, it's actually her. Good to see you again. But what you really mean? Terrible to see you again. No offense. You see, I almost had it. Oh, thank you. As we used to say. Oh, I snuck in here using the vortex manipulator I rigged up. It burnt out, but those things are cheap to at the best of times. Anyway, uh -huh. then I sealed off the cell because I created a telepathic link with the Siberian. Oh, and Siberian? let me tell you, that's not easy. You think getting through to a dentist on a Sunday morning is tricky? Walk in the park compared to establishing a dialogue with that thing. <laughs> I mean, I've made it sound more trivial than it is through a poor choice of words. And what exactly is that thing? The Siberian. Kind of like a repository of all cyber knowledge and history. It thought it was interrogating me, but I was unlocking it. So, what's the plan? Why does everyone always assume I've got a plan? I don't even know what I'm having for lunch yet. Looks like it's opened by a handprint. Not just any old hand. We need one that's limited to two fingers and a thumb. Maybe we can find some spare parts if there's some sort of conversion room. Okay. Um, but some of the Cybermen episodes are actually kind of, like, disturbing to me a little bit. Not, like, vastly disturbing, but it is kind of disturbing, the concept of the Cybermen and what they do, the upgrade. Take, they, they, like, take out all the emotion, they take away everything out of what makes a human a human. And then they kind of, you know, just strip them of that. Cybermen are supposed to not be. So there's, there's a person in here, at the very least, or it's their their head, just their brain. Does it not go further than that? Just that one? Is that down here? Sort of conversion chamber. We're too late to save those people being cybertized. Yeah. 
different iterations of Cybermen are being created. Must be experimental. Let's go. No, you're not. I hate to tell you. Help! Help! <laughs> Go back to what you were doing, nothing to see here. There's another control panel we can use. I know, but I already used it. It didn't really help at all. I don't think I will. Yeah, no. Sorry, I, I don't think either of that will work for me. find out you are a rogue element oh nope goodbye What am I doing? That doctor. An earlier version of the doctor that we've been helping, who in the normal order of things shouldn't even be here. But then again, the doctor never pays much attention to the normal order of things. He's here because of the reality virus, and he'll help you. To a point, but watch yourself. Someone says this lonely angel is step steeped in blood. The first was a very, the very first sentient creature in all creation. She saw the universe form and considers herself the mother of every living thinking species, but she's horrified by her children's cruelty and baser, in, ba baser instincts, and so she wants to wipe them out and start again. She's not actually evil, simply misguided and horrendously dangerous. This doctor. The doctor was in this form when the whole reality virus thing kicked off. She's funny and childish, excitable, but don't let that fool you. She's a wise, ancient alien who has faced death and known great loss. She's full of fun, yes, but also full of guile. For once, she needs help, your help. Without the universe, without it, the universe is doomed.
Oh. I'm stupid. We all carry our prisons Is that with us. I just developed a really bad headache. Good. Let's implement the standard operating procedure for whenever you hear an alarm. Hit the snooze button. Okay. This just in. This ship is no longer a ship. It's been redesignated. Oh. We're close to the fourth Cyber Legion now. So most of the Cybermen on board this ship can just transmat over to the main fleet, which is faster, more efficient. Gamma level security. The Cybermen know I've escaped from the cell, so they've initiated the self-destruct protocol. Huh, makes sense. Oh, no. When it's a ship, not a ship. When it's a bomb. Just to get rid of me. That's them off my Christmas card list. Right, we've got to get out of here fast. Well, fast-ish. Yes. I've got to get back in there and finish interrogating the Siberium. Find out what the Cybermen's endgame is. And you have to destroy the ship's force field so I can pull the TARDIS in. And then we can all escape. Got it. I seem to spend half my life escaping. I'm so jealous of people who just leave. Actually, it's probably a bit boring. Right. What are you waiting for? Uh, we're waiting for the slightest clue about how we take out the force field. Emma, <laughs> send you the coordinates of the unit you need to deactivate. Once you've done that, it should be easy to grab the TARDIS. I parked it fairly near. Okay. Okay. Man, this light is doing absolutely nothing. The the black light is doing better. Straight on. Okay. It's going to tell me to turn left here. Right here. Ah. Left here. It's going to say left here. All systems, but at least I memorized the deck notes. I'll guide you to the bridge. Straight on. Okay. Turn right. Oh. He's fast. He is fast. Left here. He, uh, can I, I go need to get to the top floor? Yes. Take that elevator up. Goodbye. Oh. Can the Cyber Reaper get up here? Oh, oh, oh. So I wonder, like, at least I memorized the deck plans. I'll guide you to the bridge. Straight on. So I wonder who would be in a Cyber Reaper. Uh, obviously, someone that they think is smart. Is, is, is this the only Cyber Reaper? The Cyber Reaper's getting close. Left here. Ooh. Ooh. It's right behind us. No kidding. Right here. Right here. Woo! 
Yes, thank you. I got that. Straight. Turn right. Glad I didn't go straight. Cyber Reaper's like teleporting, Please. man. Keep going. I'm going. Close it. Tin soldiers skulking around the galaxy. Very good. We're safe. For now. For now. Welcome back, fam. Oh, too early oh. to call you that? Dunno. Anyway, nice work disabling the force field. Meant I could use a Cybermen's transmat to get on board and materialize around you. I should have mentioned that part of the plan. Sorry. Short on time. Did you get anywhere mm. with the Siberian? I did. The Cybermen have upgraded the first's reality virus. Why would they want the chaos that will bring? I thought the Cybermen were all about logic and order. Yeah, at any cost. They believe the chaos their virus unleashes will make planets super vulnerable to mass cyber invasion. Okay, so they're mm. betting that societies right across the galaxies will be in no state to resist their armies. It's more than that. They think that with reality unraveling, people will actually want to be... upgraded. That entire species will welcome cyber conversion to help restore universal order. They're not short on confidence, are they? Which may prove costly for them. Their version of the reality virus is more powerful than the first. But that's because it's not organic. It needs a power source. So we just need to find it and destroy it? Them. There are three transmitters hidden in three different locations. We need to find oh, them great. all. We disable those transmitters, and this whole nightmare ends. Okay, we're about to emerge from the time vortex. Let's see what's left of the universe. Hmm? Looks like Mars, 22nd century. Something's off, though. Uh oh. <gasps> Cybermen, Daleks, Weeping Angels, Tasma, Cybermats, the first, and the Cyber Reaper. You didn't think I was gonna sit this one out, did you? Seriously? Allons-y! Oh, looks like the doctor knows where he's going. Oh! Jeez! Don't forget, we need to track down and destroy the force field units so the doctor can get the TARDIS here. Oh, hi, Weeping Angel. Everything's being turned into a Dalek. Uh, was that giant statue facing this way a minute ago? What statue? Sorry, that was delayed. Keep going, Doctor. We'll catch up. It's like teleporting. See that glowing thing? The Cybermen have built an amplifier around fragments of the first. That must be one of the reality virus transmitters. Looks like the Doctor needs a hand. Help the Doctor deactivate the transmitter. Hold tight and pretend it's a plan. Okay. I'm doing something. Wow. The time-space continuum packs quite a punch. We've been catapulted into another weak spot in reality. The next trans- Okay. We're gonna pause for a second. I'm gonna end this video, and then I'm gonna pick it back up, even though I probably should go to sleep. I will pick it back up. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!